Okay, so after finishing Project Mouse's do my walk around, and I hadn't figured out how I was going to fill the rear wiring hole for the rear license plate lights since I went to an LED bolt light, and I'm going to share that as a tech tip right now when painting. If you guys want to do a round circle, depending on how big, well it doesn't even depend on how big it is, you just take the tape and lay a bunch of pieces forming small squares all the way around the circle until you get your shape. Um, I'll go ahead and show you this and we'll go so you guys get an idea. And I'll include some still shots that are better off, but you guys can see what I was doing. So this was originally a dark navy blue like the original part of the truck. That being said, I forgot all about it when I pulled the factory license plate housing off. So you look, I mean it's already gray now, but I just took a bunch of pieces to form the circle. And all I did was fill the hole with a little rubber plug. It should be good enough to keep the snow out. Um, mask off whiter than the area you intend to spray. Because overspray, you don't want to ruin a uh, perfectly good paint job. So, hopefully that helps you guys out. Um, like I said, you can fill a lot of holes with rubber grommets if you can't weld them. Or if you might even reuse them again. I was thinking I might eventually put a dune whip on there. Or maybe a CB antenna. At least the hole is there, and for now it's going to be touched up, and you won't see it. So there's a quick tech tip.